Do you know what it takes to be a champion? To hoist the belt over your head? Six months till fight night. Time is no longer an open fire hydrant. It's a piece of bread going in the toaster. It needs to be popped at the right time. Kick yourself out of bed. Six mile run. No walking. No jogging. Every morning from now on, the rooster will count on you to wake him up. Noon time. Off to the gym. The weights aren't going to lift themselves. Don't get outworked by your opponent. Upper body endurance is more indispensable than a pilot is to a plane. It's time to conquer the battle ropes. Arms are tired? Don't stop. Just speed up. Push-ups. Pull-ups. Core work so your abs are screaming like Edvard Munch's painting. Every rep is another step toward your goal of a knockout. Being physically weak in the ring means you're just another blade of grass waiting to be cut. Nighttime. Off to the boxing studio. Jump rope is your warm-up. You think that's easy? Think again. Boxer step. Skipping. One foot. Double jump. Crisscross. Side swing. Get in the ring. It's time to train. Everything is lined up for you. The heavy bag. Speed bag. Mitts. Bob the dummy. You have to try all different kinds of combinations of punches, like you're trying to invent a new recipe. Diet and nutrition is your sidekick. It should be first in your brain's line of thought at all times. One night before the fight. The weigh-in is complete. Now it's time for the stare-down. Looking in his eyes is as serious as boot camp. This game isn't a joke. If you treat it like one, you'll be made into one when the war gets underway in between the ropes. They just called your name to enter the arena. Your heart is beating faster than a court stenographer's fingers are typing. 100,000 wolves howling and you're the moon. You're going to take a lot of damage in that ring. When you wake up the next morning, your concussion will leave you with less memory than the day you were born. Do you even remember who you fought last night? Everything is blurry. You are living like a patient after waking up from anesthesia. The sport doesn't just want your heart. You have to give it your brain too. So I'll ask you again. Do you know what it takes to be a champion? To hoist the belt over your head?